the big thing converting to Islam. Yeah. For me, religion, I've always skeptic of it. There's so many get religion, so many gods, but the Muslim yeah. community is the fastest growing community on the planet. Yeah. The Muslim community is so strong, and if they've got your back, yeah. they've got your back. One million percent. A lot of people might have said to you, "It's a power play because you are a chess man. Everything moves." Yeah. What was the decision to join Islam? The closer you find yourself to God, the closer you find yourself to Islam. That's the bottom line of it. If you're going to be atheistic like I was and then start to believe in God, and then you're going to default to Christianity like I was because I was raised Christian, and then now I live in Romania, which is the second or third most Christian nation on earth. I think it's 98% Christian in the last census, and it's Orthodox. Orthodox I respect much more than Catholic because the Pope is an agent of the Matrix. And orthodoxy is still strong and strict, and they still believe a lot of the rules and laws. But as you find yourself closer and closer to God, you find yourself closer to the idea of rigidness and the fact that there should be strict, clear boundaries and guidelines. God says yes and no. God doesn't say, well, maybe if you want to, it's okay on these days. You shouldn't, but no, God says yes and no. God is very clear. And the closer you find yourself to God, you start to want that. As a Christian, I don't know how you answer to certain questions anymore. Yes, as a true believer, but which Christians are true believers anymore? As a Christian, I don't know what the correct answer is to a lot of the degeneracy that is happening in the world today. I don't know what a Christian would say. Would they say, it's fine, we forgive them for what they're chopping kids' dicks off? Or do they say, that's wrong? What does a Christian say? I don't know. I know what a Muslim says. So it's like, it's the only religion left that makes sense to me. And uh, you say it's a brotherhood and it has your back. I didn't consider that before I joined. I've learned it's true after I joined. Yeah, it absolutely is. There's like every organization or every group of people on earth, it's, it can go both ways. There's certain people who attack me for not doing everything completely correct like I'm supposed to, even though I'm a Muslim for seven months. They're like, oh, you didn't read this bar. Or that. So you do have those people, but in general, yeah, it's a community. But I never considered that before I joined. I just found myself becoming more and more religious and finding myself speaking to God in my head more and more often, and then being very disappointed with the Christianity I see around me. How can I speak to God in my head and look for his guidance and then walk past a church and just covered in gay pride flags? It doesn't make it make sense to me. I, I, just, I just found myself alienated from Christianity. It's like, well, which religion sticks to what it means? Which religion says what it means and means what it says? Because that's the kind of person I am, and I want a religion that reflects my personality. And I want to believe that God also thinks the same way. So you end up drawn to Islam.